Hi everyone, welcome to another County Com one take video. Hey, today I'm going to show you something I've been playing with for the last couple of weeks and I really, really like and I think you will too. This is a collaboration flashlight. Meritac and Ace Beam got together and we came up with this flashlight that I think you're going to find really, really nice. Great feature set. I love the color. Uh, County Com said we want these, you know, special and to stick out and have, this is a beautiful olive drab green. I'm trying to get them to make some other colors. Uh, we'll see what, where that goes. But uh, right now, they, this is olive drab green, also limited. There's about 600 of these, and that's all there, there's going to be. But super, super nice light. Kind of reminds me of the flashlights from the 80s. Those black flashlights that cost a million bucks in the 80s. And there was you know no competition in the flashlight business. That's what it reminds me of, the size, the factor, all that. But this is a flashlight from 2020. This does a whole lot more than those flashlights from 1980 did. Um, let's start with, runs in two modes, and it depends how you program it. Yeah, you program this flashlight to do what you want it to do, and that's kind of a really cool feature. There's two general modes. There's a tactical mode, the tactical mode is a bunch of strobe lights. And you know, you have a bunch of choices in strobe lights. Me personally, not a strobe light fan. You know, give me a big bright flashlight. Give me a little light uh, flashlight. It, you know, I, I, I want white light. I'm not necessarily a fan of the strobe. If you're a fan of the strobe, run it in tactical mode. You're gonna be very happy. If you just need white light and you know, this is what you're gonna, you're gonna you are gonna like the day mode or the daily carry mode. So what I like about the daily carry mode is, look, here's the tail cap. There's two switches. We've got our rubber push button, and we have a, um, I don't know, I wanna call it a plastic, uh, what do we call that, a D-shaped, or, uh, you know, I'm sure there's a, there's a uh, term for it. We press that, and we get our momentary light. I need to go down the stairs, check the car, you know, not trip on the cat, not fall down the stairs. Yeah, momentary. I can press. I can do what I need to do. It's not overwhelmingly bright. Super bright, yes, definitely. But that is like 50 lumens. More than enough to do most of your business. Your, your battery is going to last a long, long time. Like 22 hours of, in this mode, which is just insane. And this mode is good for 99% of the things I do. Every now and then, I would need it a little brighter, right? So, but that's okay. It'll do it. Let's say, you know, I'm out doing something, you know, minor, and then all of a sudden there's a noise, scary noise in the distance, and I want it bright. All I do is I press my tail cap, and it goes to blinding white. So I got my little wimpy, wimpy navigation light. I can get through the house, get through, move around with it. That's fine. Or go super bright just by switching the tail cap. I like that. What if I'm super bright and I'm dealing with a problem? Hey, it's de-escalating. I need a little less light. All I do is I press this little side button and it will step through the modes. And this end button, the plastic mode. When I'm all done, I shut it off and I can still go back anytime to little momentary mode. What if I never ever want it super bright? I only ever want to run it in a low mode. So let's, let's turn on the light and we're gonna set whatever mode we want it to go into. And there is a, it's called turbo mode. Let's, let's just walk through this. That is turbo mode. Yeah, you can't tell, it's super, super bright. It shuts the camera down. Then I have a high mode. Well, high mode, medium mode. Now, oh, I screwed that totally up, didn't I? Let's just start fresh here. There's low mode, there's medium mode high mode, and turbo. But let's just say I only ever want to run it in medium mode. That's the mode I, you know, I never want to go to high. I never want to go to turbo. I only ever want to go to medium. And that's going to run for five hours, five hours of runtime. All I do is turn it off just by turning it off. Whenever I, you know, so here I am in my low mode and I want my medium mode, I go to this switch. This switch is now programmed to only do medium. If I want to 
you know, if I'm doing something in medium mode and I, hey, things are uh, escalating, let's go to a brighter light. All I do is I click. Well, whatever I leave, whatever mode I leave it in, when I turn it off, it's going to return to that mode. That's really, really nice. That, I, I love that it runs on 18650 battery, which is my new favorite battery. And, you know, CR123s, I can go to Walmart, I can go to 7-Eleven, run it on, on uh, CR123s if I want. I like that the head is not terribly huge and large. Um, I like that the, uh, I've got this knurled edge here. So if I do put it down on, on something, I can tell that it's on and uh, hopefully I, you know, won't cause my house to burn down or, you know, me to leave a mark on the, uh, the, uh, on the upholstery or anything like that. But just a real simple, simple light. Instructions. The instructions are going to come with it. Super, super small. You can find them bigger online. Um, you know, just if you wanted to change your mode, but it's kind of real simple. It's you turn it on, figure out what mode you like, like it in, you know, and turn it off. It's going to return to that mode automatically. You want something simple, small light. There you go. This is really, this is your small light access. And then when it, when the bright light is on, that lets you rotate through your different modes. Now you kept the light really low in here just in, because it just overrides the, uh, the camera. But I wanted you to take a look at this. This is one of my new favorite flashlights. I love the 18650s. I love the CR123 uh, ability. If, like I said, and I am not, like I said, I'm not a fan of the strobe. Um, I know that there, there are plenty of you out there. If you are a fan of the strobe, it does a whole bunch of different strobe modes. I wanna say like five different strobe modes. Um, let me tell you, let me see if I can pull up some info on that. Uh, you know, the anti-roll design, yeah, it doesn't, that clip does not want it to, to want it to roll. They call this a tactical scalloped head. Okay, that's that's nice. Um, you know, love the adjustable modes. Um, you know, it uses a uh, SFT40 LED module, which doesn't mean anything to me. Uh, our the flashlight guys here are all thrilled with that. They think that's terrific. Uh, I'm less of a flashlight guy, more of a user. I just want it to use it. I want it to be simple. I want it to be uh, super bright. Um, just, you know, I want it to work without having, and I don't want to have to go to school to do it. So, yeah. And so this is, like I said, this is a County Com exclusive. They are telling me right now that it is very, very limited. Um, you know, there are, there are a limited number of it. You know, your 18650 will work fine. We, we have some great 18650 deals with, uh, with chargers and stuff like that. I, you know, take a look at that. I think you'll like that. Um, I think that just about covers it. Am I missing anything? I'm looking around. Everybody's, uh, four lighting modes in the tactical mode and a, and a one touch strobe. And then you get four lighting modes. You also get SOS, uh, maximum, uh, output is 1800 lumens per minute. How about that? 1800 lumens period. Good. You get 22 hours of maximum runtime. That's at that little dim area, which I find perfect for navigation around the home. Uh, you know, it's all it's all good. Yeah, I think you're gonna find this to be quite the light. Uh, they're talking about 1600 feet throw, which I totally believe. Um, I haven't gone out and measured it, but it's, it's it really gets out there and uh, and penetrates uh, you know distance. Okay, well I hope you like this video. Um, I'm not a flashlight guy and, you know, like I said, I'm not a flashlight guru. I just know what I like. I think you're going to like this too. So this is the Defender P16 by Meritac. Thanks. Take care. See if I can get you a good picture of that end as we tail cap as we end.